welcome or welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a very very special video i have a very special guest today on my channel her name is merin fatima and she is in first year of nit calicut and she is also an ex ssac student and guys she scored whopping 99.7 percentile in j with a rank of 198 how did you prepare for the examination like you have got in nit so you have got through j uh, j paper 2 so how did you prepare for the examination what were the mistakes you did anything that you want to share from the viewers and from the students who are going to appear for the examination now and your experience regarding the preparation uh, yeah so my first exam before giving it Uh, my impression was that if i can score since there are three parts in je after you drawing and math so i thought that if i can score um, in drawing and aptitude i can ace it and you know i can clear the exam but it's mm-hmm. not like that and another thing that i want to tell students is that don't be scared of math like i was terrified of math in my before my first right so i didn't attempt it at all i'll tell you out of 25 questions i attempted four questions <laughs> only the four <laughs> questions and but my percentile was 60 in math mm. so you what you need to understand is that with these exams hard work won't really get you far what mm. you have to do is you have to work for things smartly in a very smart manner mm. so uh, the thing is what you have to understand is that all these students who are appearing for the je exam the architecture exam their mm. weak point is math so the only way you can score better than all these people is if you score higher in math because majority are not going to score very well in math but if you have a better percentile in math you always have an upper hand so you will mm-hmm. get a better rank in math so the mm-hmm. problem with me was my first attempt i was very scared of math i was really scared because there was also a negative marking so i was like i'm not going to attend much math because i'm scared of getting negative marks mm-hmm. so i got a 95 percentile in math i mean in uh, je the first attempt only because my percentile in math came down Hmm. But if I did prepare for math and attempt it really well, then I could have gotten, I could have uh, cleared it in the first try itself. Hmm. But because I didn't, I had to sit for another try as well. And this time, I focused on math and I enrolled for SSAC courses. And Anil sir was, uh, he was such a lifesaver for me because hmm. um, I did enroll in another co- another uh, another course as well. But it didn't really help me in math as much because. one thing you also have to uh, keep in mind before choosing uh, an institute is that especially for math because we're focusing on j math here is that uh, the way they teach for math it can be very very different for j what you have to understand is you have to under, uh, you have to study math in a very like from a very exam point of view hmm. learning like all 12th and like 11th 12th ncert won't help you Morning. what you have to understand yeah what you have to understand is you have to study from past papers you have to have someone who can guide you in that way that was very important for me because i was really clueless i didn't know where to start in math and i didn't have that much time i only had like probably around 2 months for my second try and mm-hmm. there was also not time between so that's a lot of pressure and you can't you don't have the time to like focus on start from like ncert 11th grade and 12th and, and there is no guarantee that you will get those uh, questions in je but even though uh, je paper 2 is the chip way to math is a lot easier than jp one math but you need that kind of guidance and that i got from anil sir so what he would do is like he would uh, pinpoint the topics that were going to come like especially the topics where you can score better mm-hmm. so i i just practiced his questions over and over again and that's all you need that's all that helped me and i got a 99 i got a 98 percentile in math alone In mm-hmm. my J second attempt, I guess he even that, used to say he you just practice these questions, the questions I'm yeah. giving you. <laughs> he yeah. even used to say I that. Mean, yeah. <laughs> so, last, uh, Anil sir would be like, you only need to do these questions. If you do anything more than that, you will be confused and you will mess up your exam. Right. So it's a little hard to like trust that, right? But then mm-hmm. I was like, this is the only choice I have. I'm going to trust his word and I'm going to keep practicing the same questions that I got from him. so he pin he took a few topics that i had to focus on and mm-hmm. which and he took these topics considering like the past uh, 20 almost past 10 20 years papers mm-hmm. and he you know he kind of uh, considered the pattern of questions and the topics where they coming from so he he gave us questions according to that 
and i will tell you those same patterns came i can't tell you the same questions came mm-hmm. but the same patterns came so i was able to like confidently attempt and i attempted 21 out of 25 questions in my second try That's and great. i got <laughs> and i got 18 of them correct i got wow. 18 of them correct amazing so, yeah so yeah so i would just say just <laughs> especially with adil sir just practice the questions he give you but you have to be consistent with it you can't keep all these questions for the last moment and like you know you can't pull off math like that you just have to be consistent and do the questions that he gives you uh, properly and understand the concepts and i don't mm-hmm. another thing is that you don't have to study all the topics from math you have to focus on some topics mm-hmm. which has like maximum weightage and the weightage sometimes like varies a little bit every year so we know guys a lot of you are very tense ki itna kam time bacha in the examination how will you prepare the mathematics portion and that is why we have brought this special crash course for you it's 100% tumhara maths part crack ho jayega jbr examination mein so what are you waiting for guys to enroll in the course you simply need to go through our website by clicking on the link mentioned in the description box of the video thank you all of you